Hello friends, as we saw in the last video, irrational numbers also exist on the number line, just like rational numbers and we also learned about addition subtraction on irrational numbers. In this video, we shall learn about irrational numbers multiplication. We know square root of 2 means 2 to the power 1 by 2, that is 2 as the base and 1 by 2 as the exponent. Same way square root of 3 is equal to 3 to the power 1 by 2. What will be the value of square root of 2 into square root of 3? That will be equal to 2 to the power 1 by 2 into 3 to the power 1 by 2. We know a to the power m into b to the power m is equal to ab whole to the power m. That is if base are different and exponent are same, we can multiply both the bases and put a bracket and put the exponent outside the bracket. So here a is equal to 2, b is equal to 3 and m is equal to 1 by 2. So square root of 2 into square root of 3 is, will be equal to 2 into 3 whole to the power 1 by 2 which is 6 to the power 1 by 2 which is square root of 6. Because exponent of 1 by 2 is same as square root. Let us take another example. Simplify 3 into bracket 3 plus square root of 3. We know a into b plus c is equal to ab plus ac. Means when we multiply an algebraic expression by a number, we multiply every term by that number. So here a is equal to 3, b is equal to 3 and c is equal to square root of 3. So we first multiply by 3 by 3 and 3 by square root of 3 and then add the two products. So it is 3 into 3 plus 3 into square root of 3 which is equal to 9 plus 3 square root of 3. We cannot simplify it further. Let us take another example. Simplify 3 minus square root of 3 into 3 plus square root of 3. We use the same rule a into b plus c is equal to ab plus ac but consider a as 3 minus square root of 3, the entire thing. So if we first multiply 3 minus square root of 3 by 3 and we multiply 3 minus square root of 3 by square root of 3 and then add the two products. So it becomes 3 into 3 minus square root of 3 plus square root of 3 into 3 minus square root of 3. Now again we simplify both the terms. The left terms becomes 3 into 3 minus 3 square root of 3 which is 9 minus 3 square root of 3 and the right term becomes 3 square root of 3 minus square root of 3 into square root of 3 and we know square root of 3 into square root of 3 is 3 so it will be 3 square root of 3 minus 3 so the final thing is 9 minus 3 square root of 3 plus 3 square root of 3 minus 3 here 3 square root of 3 and minus 3 square root of 3 cancels each other just like x minus x so it becomes 9 minus 3 which is equal to 6. We can solve this problem in another way. Do you remember the algebraic identity a plus b into a minus b equal to a square minus b square? If we think 3 as a and square root of 3 as b, we can easily say it is in the form of a plus b into a minus b. So its answer should be a square minus b square that is 3 square minus square root of 3 whole square. So 3 square is 9 and square root of 3 square means square root of 3 into square root of 3 which is 3. So it is 9 minus 3 which is 6.